It takes a brave man to commission the bike from El Solitario. Founder David Loner Doris is famed for his wayward, mischievous intelligence and his small crew of Galician cannibals, as they describe themselves, build bikes that incite controversy. Two years ago, El Solitario wrapped a BMW R9 net in stainless steel rods, creating the world's first Bosazolku chopper racer. The reaction from the interwebs was intense, to say the least. But it didn't stop Imaha Europe product manager Sean Mizarra from knocking on Doris' door earlier this year. Mizawa wanted El Solitario to oversee the final yard built XJR 1300 of 2015, celebrating 20 years of the iconic street machine. The result is a rage-inspired track monster that lives up to its name, Big Bad Wolf. BBW broke cover for the first time at the Glensack 101 Festival in Germany last month, lining up on the drag strip. The goal, to end the reign of defending sprint champion Messi B. Lawrence and his famous Lucky Cat Garage Sprint Beamer. Despite the transition from street machine to pure race bike, El Solitario stayed true to the yard built ethos. There's no frame cutting or welding on Big Bad Wolf. But it didn't make the project easy. El Solitario is not familiar with four cylinder bikes, says David Norris. For months we tried to answer the question how could we take it further? The only answer was to focus on performance and technology. Both were unknown and expensive paths for us. We are motorcycle poets, not engineers. Doris pulled together.